Hey, welcome back. In one of the groups that I'm in, uh, a user has a question about fitting text um, along the curve of a path inside uh, what is a banner element in some artwork that he's got. Um, I wanted to show you uh, how I would go about this. Um, there are uh, a couple other ways, but I'm going to show you how I would do it. What I would do is I would take this banner element and I would just go to the pencil tool or the line tool and I would draw a line from this corner here to this corner here and then using the let's put that on a layer uh, that we can see a little better and then using the nodes tool I'm going to select the nodes tool edit nodes tool I'm going to come over to this side and I'm going to hit um, I'm going to click it and hit S I'm going to turn that into a curve I'll just curve that up uh, around here for now and I'll come to this side and I'll click this side of the curve and I'm just going to start kind of matching this curve here this is uh, this is similarly how you would do this with the pen tool in Illustrator uh, if you wanted to use that software so I'll go ahead and just fit this as closely as I can to this curve and that looks that looks pretty good. I could um, I could spend a little more time on this to get it perfect if I wanted to, but you get the point. Now that I've got my line, I'll just drag it down here so you can see it. I'm going to enter in some text. I'm just going to enter in my name. And now I'm going to select the text, select the line, and I'm going to go up to Tools, Apply Path to Text. Now I've got my text in a shape that will fit right inside of this banner. Now I do have this path here, and I just want to make sure that nothing happens with that path. We don't burn it or anything. So I'm going to put the path itself on a layer that's not going to be outputted. Um, and then that way uh, we're not burning that. And if I hit preview, you can see that it is not in fact going to burn that path, and our text is aligned to our curve. I hope that helps, and check out my other videos on Lightburn.